Flat Earth Proof 18 Gravity or Density On the ball earth, there's no real up or down. It's all relative to the center, and this is possible thanks to gravity. Now, naturally, a spinning object tends to keep other objects from sticking to it due to centrifugal force, normally causing the objects to fly right off. But on the ball earth, thanks to gravity of course, people, buildings, and even the very air are all stuck to the surface of the ball and would be none the wiser had it not been for authorities such as Galileo, Newton, and NASA to tell us otherwise. Thusly, considering gravity, if objects with mass are attracted towards each other, why hasn't there ever been an object massive enough to demonstrate that water would stick to it, as is claimed the oceans, lakes, and rivers do on a ball earth? And if the excuse is then given that the earth's gravity would far supersede that of any other object, then how is it that the moon is said to affect water levels at sea level on earth? Further, how is the combined mass of a helium-filled balloon repelled by the mass of the Earth? Or, what up there is attracting the balloon to itself? Or are these really just the laws of density and buoyancy, with up and down actually existing as we perceive? Obviously, dense objects sink when placed in a less dense medium, and this law of density buoyancy perfectly explained the physics of falling objects long before Isaac Newton proposed his theory of gravity. But Isaac Newton was a knight of the British order, and I personally find it strange that he was allegedly born on Christmas Day and died on the vernal equinox. And why did his coat of arms have two cross bones on a black shield? Was he indeed a Freemason? or Rosicrucian? I also question Galileo and his supposed experiments dropping his balls from the Leaning Tower of Pisa, while Giordano Bruno and other contemporaries of Galileo were burned at the stake after being publicly tortured, Galileo was merely placed under supposed house arrest, while his associations with the Jesuits have long been acknowledged. So investigate the subject for yourself and ask questions.